what is up everybody hope you're having a fantastic day today okay because today we're going to create a platformer game from scratch and not just that we are going to create this game on zero budget which means that we are going to use only free game development tools okay guys this is probably going to be a long video so maybe i'm going to break it into like three or four parts okay so but uh, it will be the same video see if we can do it in one hour for the tools uh we are going to use um gdevelop as our main tool okay this is a uh, now gdevelop is an open source game engine okay anyone can make games and if you want to sell your games go ahead sell your games that is all that is always a good thing if you can sell your creations for graphics you don't have to worry because um this has a, a graphic editor uh, that comes with it well it's the pixel art editor and that's all we're going to need for this um, uh tutorial whatever you want to call it i will say this is more like a vlog kind of thing i just wanted to document um me creating a very simple uh platformer game okay something simple nothing too fancy it's gonna be sort of like mario okay and uh in the previous video we created these um uh, textures and these two and these two pictures okay did you guys find a name for this because uh yeah we should pick a name for this so maybe you guys uh, can come up with a name or something i'll check the comments later so we can officially name him something he's not mario now he's not a plumber he's just an exterminator i think i don't think you can copyright wearing a hat and an overhaul okay he doesn't rescue princesses he doesn't deal with mushroom kingdoms and things like that he's just he's just a regular guy with a with an overall all right and a hat so for sound we're going to use uh i'm going to use adobe edition but this is a very old version of adobe edition okay i don't even think you can get this anymore uh you might be able to get this on uh, oldversion.com i believe they keep track of uh, pieces of software that companies no longer support okay i think you can use it i'm not sure you're gonna have to check on that all right this program is free and uh, maybe we should just use this i don't know it's kind of like the same thing let me just download it Audacity for the Windows. I think I already have it. I'm not sure. That's the tools we're gonna use. Um, I don't think we need anything else. Now I'm gonna use the sound program only to generate a couple of sounds. I'm not going to um, use this um, extensively, okay? So I just wanna filter out my voice and put it like high pitch, like make like a jump sound like okay so that's it guys uh let's get started so in the next video we are going to get started 